The Special Area for Agricultural Development Program is a locally funded project of the Department of Agriculture. It hopes to provide interventions to farmers not reached by the regular banner programs of DA. Its ultimate goal is to uplift the lives of the poorest of the poor farmers in the country. In 2018, Bicol Region was selected and the provinces of Masbate, Catanduanes, and Sorsogon were chosen as target areas based on their poverty incidence and the island equity principle. One program, three provinces, 18 municipalities, thousands of farmer beneficiaries. Bakit saad? Bakit saad? Bakit saad? Bakit saad? Saad ang nagbigay ng oportunidad sa aming mga magsasaka. Natatawan kami ni Indrinda Kiliya kung paano mas maging produktibo ang samuyang pagtatanong. Sa saad, yaon ang sen ng pag-inuha na kay Puan magtanong tanganing mabuhay. Ako kayong tabang ang gihatag sa amua sa mga tao ng mga pugri na nakahawa sila sa kalisod. Ang saad kasi, kaya kami sumusuporta kasi sinusuporta ang pangangailangan. Farmers who reside in the remote and marginalized communities of the region were the primary target of saad. Despite the restrictions and additional protocols brought by the COVID-19 pandemic, Saad Bicol continues to fulfill its promise of reaching and helping the farmers residing in the far-flung areas of the region. As of November 30, 2021, Saad has trained a total of 2,443 farmer beneficiaries through the conduct of 88 trainings on rice, corn, high-value crops, livestock, and organic agriculture production and enterprise development, including the conduct of the high-value crops farmer field school season-long training to facilitate the transfer of knowledge so that the farmers can maximize the resources given to them. The trainings were conducted following the minimum health standards and COVID care kits composed of face masks, alcohol, and face shields were given to the beneficiaries on top of their usual training kits. Further, the program fully supports the battle cry of the Department of Agriculture, Masaganang Ani at Mataas Nakita, through the provision of apt agricultural interventions and machineries which can cut the production costs of our farmers, thereby increasing their income. The program has distributed an approximate amount of 120 million worth of inputs and farm implements to a total of 152 farmer associations and 1,430 individual farmer beneficiaries from the marginalized areas of Masbate, Catanduanes, and Sorsogon under different commodities such as rice, corn, high-value crops, organic agriculture, and livestock. Under the Rice Production and Enterprise Development Project, 14 packages had been implemented which benefited 30 rice farmer associations and 1,430 individual farmers. Under the Corn Production and Enterprise Development Project, 4 packages were implemented which helped 9 corn farmer associations. Under the High Value Crops and Enterprise Development Project, six packages were implemented which benefited 51 High Value Crops Farmer Associations and 18 Organic Agriculture Farmer Associations. And under the Livestock Production and Enterprise Development Project, 15 packages were implemented which benefited 13 Goat Farmer Associations. 16 Chicken Farm Associations, and 15 Duck Farmer Associations. Some of the Farmer Associations of the program are participating in the Kadiwa, or the Katuwang Sadiwa at Gawa, para sa masaganang ani at mataas na kita. 
a marketing strategy of DA, bridging the gap between the producers and the consuming public, while others are selling their produce in their respective barangays and municipalities. Further, a regional results-based monitoring and evaluation rapid appraisal was also conducted in the provinces of Sorsogon and Catanduanes with the participation of the SAD National Program Management Office, Regional Program Management Support Office, and the Provincial Program Management Support Office. This November 2021, two former associations from Catanduanes and two from Sorsogon were visited during the said activity. There is still some work to be done, but with the perseverance and teamwork of the provincial local government units, municipal local government units, barangay officials, SAD implementers, and the farmers, the actualization and fulfillment of the promise can be achieved. Bakit saad? Ang saad ay hindi madamot sila ay mapagbigay. Hindi nila binibigyo ang kanilang pangako. Ha,